Hey everybody, this is Fully Earth and welcome back to another episode of Minecraft on the AlphaCraft server. I want to start by thanking each and every one of you for all of the comments I had about the house from last week. Uh, again, blown away by your comments and your interaction. Thank you very, very much. I really do appreciate it. Now this place is starting to come together. Smurfy, as usual, as he has been doing for, for several weeks now, has been working away on the uh, on those... Okay. Are those... <laughs> Smurfy, are those windows in the right place? No, stop looking, stop looking. Smurfy's been doing a lot of work over there. Uh, and if you've not been checking out his stream, then you should do, because it's really good fun. But he's been doing all the work in the mansion. And he's also built that fantastic windmill. And thanks again to Steena. And thanks to uh, to Dreamer for helping Smurfy out over there. He's also built a little fishing hut here. Now we've had a chat with uh, I've had a chat with Smurfy about that. We're not sure at the moment whether that should stay there because it's sort of bang in the middle of the little village, or whether we should move that over there somewhere. But we'll talk about that later. And that's Smurfy's house from uh, early one in the week. So this place is starting to come together. And I'm loving it. I'm loving this new found love of building. Loving the love of building. But what we need, I need you got I need help from you guys. Uh, we need a name for this village, this little village. So uh, you know, just let me know. Let me know what you think. What we should be calling this thing, uh, Mushroomsville or something. Just make something up and lob it in the comments below, uh, and we'll have a chat about it myself and Smurf. And you know, the the best one, we'll we'll uh, we'll call it the village. But anyway, what I'm going to do today, as he turns around, I've got milk as well. I've been, we've been inundated with, with pillagers. They've been everywhere. They've been up on the roof, been over there by the windmill. They've been over there. I spawned in the other day, logged in the other day, and there were like 15 of them all messing about, having a bit of a pool party stuck in the middle of there, which, uh, which was a bit scary. So I've taken to running around with a bucket of milk on me because I don't want to cause any raids around the mansion. Anyway, I digress. Again, what I'm going to do, I think we're going to put the... I think we're going to put it here. And I've got a design, rough design in my head, uh, which I'm going to be working to. And again, like I did last week, because that went down quite well, and I appreciate the feedback, as I mentioned, uh, I'm going to be doing a bit of a time-lapse of me building... Uh, using the replay mod, which is a superb mod. If you haven't got it and, you, and, and you're into making videos and that kind of thing, it's fantastic. You really should give it a go. Uh, so I'll do a bit of that and uh, every so often I'll pop back and, and we'll have a chat about what I've done. So without further ado, I'll crack on and start doing a bit of building. So that's the basic framework of it, uh, and as per this one, I'm going to put stone at the bottom. I'm going to put a bit of uh, a bit of mushroom in the middle. I'm, I was going to use brown, and then the white stems, and then brown again. But I might try to stick a little bit of red in there. I've got I've got some red mushrooms, so I might try and stick a bit of red in there just to see what it looks like. Uh, but I worry about doing the bottom in a minute. Uh, but I need some brown mushrooms to start with. I might need a few more than that. A few stems. I'll get a bit of glass while I'm at it. No, I won't. Get a bit of glass there while I'm at it. Now, I think this one, I'm going to have uh, one window at the bottom and the door probably here. And then on this level, I'm going to have like three panes of glass with a window box. I'm a big fan of window boxes. Now, a couple of you have asked why I build my houses top heavy. And there's, there's only one reason for it, really. I just really like, I just really like how they look. 
Um, and in fairness, you really don't have to follow the laws of physics in Minecraft anyway, do you? So that may well topple over if it was a real house. But in Minecraft, I just think that looks so pretty. So I like it. So this is going to be... This is, in fact, most of my houses are going to be top heavy. Uh, so I do it because I can, really, for no other reason. Uh, okay, birch. Get some birch and I'll fill the floor in and then put the, uh, the mushroom blocks around the middle and throw in some windows. Okay, so at first glance, I'm not, I'm not liking that. That's not grippered me. However, you really can't start to see what it looks like until we've started putting the, uh, the window surrounds in and the window box in and the, uh, the supports. I'm going to be sticking some fences in there as a, as a support. So I'll leave it there for the time, but it's going to be easy enough to take it out from the inside later. So I'll leave it there for the time being. So what I'm going to do now is make the. I think I'll make this, the roof and I, I tend to make the roofs first. Uh, so I'll make the roof and then I'll put the, 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 the paraphernalia around the outside of the, the first floor. And then I'll come down and I'll do the bottom floor last. And that sort of tends to give me a, a better idea of, of what I'm doing. Uh, which is the way I work. So, so anyway, I'm going to grab some. I think I'll, I'll use andesite for... The andesite and shall I use dark oak again or shall I just use oak? What have I got lots of? I've got a bit of oak. Maybe I'll use andesite and oak. Let's give it a go. Yeah, liking that. So I'll uh, I'll put the rest of the roof on, then do the the fascia at the at the front here. So I'm going to stick a couple of uh, flower beds at the front. Cause I like my flower beds. Like that, get a couple of uh, bits of grass in there. I've been digging grass up again with a silk touch pick, so sorry about that, everybody. Don't hate me. Some of those, and hmm. some of those. Uh, right, and I'll start on the on the roof. So I think I'm going to run all the way across a little bit like that one. We're going to have a like a, a gutter, or whatever you'd call it, the ridge. The, the, sorry, the, the the I don't know what you'd call it, but anyway, this bit here is all going to be andesite, and then the main roof bit is going to be made out of oak. I think we said, didn't we? And then I think we'll just stick a ridge of uh, a ridge of uh, an andesite along the top, and then put some slabs on top of that. Uh, maybe just put a little uh, I'm into these kind of things. I don't know what they're called. I'm sure, one of you can tell me, but I like them. And then just ridge it with andesite slabs. Yeah. Now I, I was thinking about sticking a window in the side of it, but I'm gonna I'm not gonna do that on this one. No, I'm not. I'm gonna leave that for another build. Let's 
We've got plenty of room to do plenty of other builds. Right, so far. That red isn't that bad, is it? I don't think it's that bad now. Starting to grow on me a little bit. Just a little bit. Now, I think I mentioned I'm oh, looking at putting fencing up the side as like a support and to give it a bit of variation, something to look at, that kind of thing, up the sides here. The more different textures I've got, the the better it looks, I think. Obviously, you can go OTT on it, but I, I, I like that. I like that. Uh, so we'll have some... If we have this... Like that. Um, what do we reckon? What do we reckon about that? That's not bad. That's not bad, actually. Yeah. Need something at the top, though, don't we? Now, I don't think this is big enough up here to have another window box. So we're just going to have an upside down stair there. Like that. Yeah, and then a couple of those there. Um, do I have slabs there I think I might have slabs there have a slab there have a slab there have an have a stair there 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 um, oh didn't think I was going to fall down there oh I don't know about that not sure about that now no, I don't like that at all. Oh my word, I'm gonna kill myself. I've got no food either. Can you eat mushroom blocks? That'd be ideal, wouldn't it? No, actually that's not bad, it's better. Maybe I'll play about with that last thing when I get all the scaffolding down and everything. I can have a proper look at it. So now I need to do exactly the same thing uh, around each side. I think I'm going to use that around each one of the sides. And then that over the back as well. And then I'll start work on the bottom. But I am going to go and sleep first. Bad guys. So I'm kind of liking that. I uh, uh, the, the the red is growing on me, so that's uh, that's a, that's a result actually. Yeah, a bit of colour. I like that. Uh, and also, I've put in. I've extended the beam there. I've extended that out and put a uh, a button on a stone button on the outside of it because I'm a big fan of putting buttons on the end of on the end of logs. Uh, and I was wondering whether it looked better with the log sticking out the support, sticking out of the roof there, or whether it was better hiding it behind the roof, the stairs. And I think I'm liking that. So I think I'm going to do that all the way around. And it's starting to come together. Liking it. So I'll do the, the rest of the roof and put the buttons on. Uh, make a couple more trap doors to go around the flower beds and then we'll start work on the bottom We'll come up with a design for the bottom floor for the ground floor
Made the mistake there, didn't I? Easily fixed. Right, that, that, that. Whip these out. What did we have in there? Just slabs, didn't we? I think. Oh no, we had... What did we? Oh, we had slabs and then slabs and then slabs. And which one looks the best then? Let's have a look. The top there where I'm looking, that the slabs above the, the top window in a upside down V. Or the slabs there straight across now the, the V. It's the V every day of the week. Uh, while I'm up here, I think I'll, if I do the upside down V, I can't put a, can't put a lantern above there, can I? And I like my lanterns. Hmm. Big fan of putting lan that, the lanterns above windows. Can't do it like that. So do I get rid of that and that and have a solid block there, maybe? I'm not digging that. Not digging that at all. What about... What about if I have... Oh... Have I run out of those as well? Oh, this is an absolute nightmare. Okay. It's too low. Too low. I don't like that. May well be that I won't be having a lantern up here. Hmm. Don't know how I feel about that. Don't know how I feel about that. Gonna have to have a think about that one because I'm not uh, I'm not convinced at the moment. Anyway, I'll worry about the lanterns later. What we need to do now is stick the bottom in. So if this this is gonna be the door. Stick a bit of birch down the bottom there for the door. And then we're going to have a, a mixture again of stone and cracked stone and andesite uh, around the bottom. Pretty much like this one. I do like the look of that. Um, and at the bottom, I think I'm also going to have two windows like this. Oh, should I have three? Oh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to have to put them in. Put them in and see. Don't just talk about it, frills. All right, so I have some cracked stuff. Get rid of my mushroomies. Some of those. Get rid of my shield. Uh, put my shield away. Don't need my mushrooms, do I? Andesite, cobble. Have I got any stone on me? I've got a, bit, a little bit of stone on me. I've got my cracked. Uh, have I got my normal? Normal stone. Hmm. Uh, normal stone brick, sorry. Mm, Smurfy's got one. Oh, he's got a bit of stone though. I'll nick that. So I'm just going to fill the bottom up now with with stone brick and whatever. Actually, I'm just going to fill it with yeah, fill it with I'll oh, fill it with anything. It makes no difference, does it? Really, for goodness sake. Just to start with. Now, obviously, that's very plain. You can see it's very plain. I do like the look of that with the with the slabs at the bottom like that. Oh, 
I I wonder. I wonder if we whip these out. Let me whip these out and replace these with stairs. Oh, I like that. I like that. Yeah. I like that. And then I have a, uh, have a lantern at the top. Or should I have it one further down? Should I? Mm. Oh, I don't, don't, yeah, don't mind that at all. Don't mind that. So I think we'll, we'll, we'll do this design all the way around then. And then, uh, and then we'll start just whipping a couple of these bricks out, changing them for cobble and for cracked stone and the rest of it. You know what it's like, you know what I'm going to be doing. So here's me building out in the dark again, but I'm I'm liking that now. I like that a lot. I'm going to try something now. And again, let me know what you think. But if I turn these around and have them facing like that, does that, does that add anything to the build, do you think? So that's with them square. Hi, Stina. Oh, sorry. Hi, spider. And that's with them. I I like that. I like that better. I I, I like that. So we're going to stick with that. Let me know. Let me know what you think. But I like. I prefer that a little bit more. So now all I'm doing now is is titivating it. Stop sniggering. It's a perfectly normal word to use. I like that a lot now. So that's good. Now I I was going to put lanterns on the windows. Because I like putting lanterns on windows there. But it brings the lantern right down, bang in front of the window. Or I can take that out altogether and have the lantern there. Or I can leave that how it was and have the lanterns hanging from the corners of the building. Which I'm which I like. I like that. It's difficult to see when it's not light. Say hi to Spider. Everybody say hi to Spider. But then where am I going to hang them from the top? I'm going to have to hang them from there, aren't I? So let's get up there and put in some, some scaffolding. Hang something underneath. It's probably going to be stone brick or stone bricks again. And then hang the lantern from there. Don't 
Do I put andesite in there? You see where they, that stair is there? Do I? It looks just a little bit odd, don't you think? I think it does look a little bit odd. Let me run up there and swap this over. This is a lot of trial and error, but then house building is when you're not building to a plan. There's a lot of messing about. Do I like that better? Would I like it better if it was all andesite? I, I like that better, if I'm being honest. And I'm probably going to have to put something in there as well, underneath underneath the eaves there. Mm. Do I put wood up there? No, that would look odd, wouldn't it, if I put a wood beam up there? I'll probably put andesite up there. Oh. Nope. Is that too andesite it is, isn't it? Need something else up there. What what would mushroom block look like? Oh, I'm starting to mess about now. That does look a little bit too Anderson. Well, what about what about if I just put that up there? Oh, that might not be bad. I might ooh, I might have just stumbled upon that. That looked okay, didn't it? Yeah, no, I like that. I like that. Glad I didn't go up there with mushroom blocks now. So, lanterns in the corners. Probably going to... Not there. Corners, frills. Corners. Uh, now, do I want that to be brick? Yeah, no, I do. I do. Are they breaking? Oh, they're breaking on the button. Oh, you wouldn't believe it, would you? On the button. Get that there. Yeah. This is going to be a little bit too dark in front of the windows, so without taking that out and putting a no, no, not going to do it. So what I'll do, I'll give you a quick fly around now to to see what it looks like. Probably, I'm going to put some andesite stairs in the ceiling don't think I'm going to put a chimney in this one or maybe I will do later I don't think I will do though and then I'm going to grab some greenery can't beat a bit of greenery and I think we'll stick a fork in it and call it done Now, as I mentioned, I do think I've got a little bit too much foliage on the roof, but like I said, I'll walk away from it. I love that house. But I don't mind that house. You'll have to let me know what you think about the red. I'm, it's, you know, I look at it one minute and I think that looks really nice. And then I look at it the next minute and I'm not so sure. 
I'm going to leave it. I'm going to leave it and let you uh, let you tell me what you think. So there you go. Quick flyby. And that's me done for today. So thank you very much for watching again, everybody. I really do appreciate it. If you have enjoyed this episode, please don't forget to leave it a like. And if you've really loved it, don't forget to subscribe for future videos. And don't forget to check out all the other alphas. Pigglesworth joined us this week. A fantastic builder, really good fun. Go and check out his channel. Link is in the description below. This is Frilly Off, and I'm out of here.